it's like a, a magazine subscription you could do and you would get a um, new comic book every two weeks or so and uh, I got quite a, quite a few as you can see so I haven't read all of them but I've read most of them and some of my favourites are volume 50 there, Craven's Last Hunt volume 53 which is just called Marvels um, what now? <laughs> I think there's Avengers Forever which is Sorry, but you're 
just in case, you know, for like moving reasons, it's very much so easy just to store them in there and move them quite easily. So yeah, I do like to keep those boxes for future uh, reasons. Uh, so there we do have my wardrobe. Uh, I can't actually open it because my ring lights in a way. I'm using both my hands. But um, yeah, nothing really too much going in there. Just uh, well, just pretty much all my clothes really. Um, and then we get to the more interesting part of my wardrobe. So I guess we'll start from <coughs> the bottom and work our way up. So here is where I have all of my vinyls. And if we can get a closer look. See what ones I have. So I have Super Organism, their debut album. We have uh, All Over the World by uh, Electric Like Orchestra. We have The Guns of Galaxy Volume 2. We have 21 Pilots, Blurry Face. Um, back when I used to like 21 Pilots. We have two very rare vinyls. These are actually Art of Monkey, uh, but they're live albums, so they're from live concerts. And then we have um, Whatever People Say I Am. That's what I'm not. Nightmare, Drunkard Base Hotel and Casino. And then we have Blur Park Life. And then here we get to all the Gorillas albums. So Gorillas, Demon Days, Plastic Beat, Humans, The Now Now. Uh, I don't have the Song Machine. Uh, I do need to get that. And I don't have um, the new one. I forgot what it's called. It's called. Um, actually, I can't remember what it's called, but it's actually a pretty good album. And then we have some Amy Winehouse, some Kelly Uchis, uh, Isolation album. And then we have the Sims, sometimes I might be introvert. I really need to pick up Grey Area. Grey Area is, I think, one of the best albums of all time, so I really need to pick that up on vinyl. And then we have Brockhampton, Iridescence, Tyler the Great Eagle, uh, Kitsy Ghost by, well, you know, uh, Connie Weston Kikari. And then we have This Beam of Elden Ring, the final collection, limited edition, uh, which I picked up last year. And then we have two Pokemon binders here, just to fill up the space. And then here we have some G Fuel. Oh, let me just position myself. Here we have the first stack of G Fuel. I've got a G Fuel cup there, and we do have, like I said, my mic arm stand just here. Um, so right now there's just a lot of empty space. I do plan to, when I get more books, start stacking them along with this bit here. And um, yeah, so right now nothing could do much going here, just a stack of G Fuel. Um, so here, uh, a, little bit, a little bit more going on again, I have a stack of G Fuel, uh, this one is more so the drink, it's up the tops that I normally drink from, and these are like some of the ones I drink less from, but I mean, I still like all of them, but we also have some more Lego, Lego figurines, so we got Baby Yoda, and the Lego Bonsai Tree, which I actually built on the channel, I originally started building this one on the channel, but then I built the second half on so, uh, yeah, do Lego builds, really fun Lego builds. I think they just look really nice. Lego, I think it's just good for decorations. And maybe I could actually put some, some more Lego there. Maybe move something from over there. And put it there just to, just to fill up the space a little bit more. Make it a little bit more, you know, nicer, nicer to look at. And then finally at the top part we have the Pokemon section. So pretty much it's just made from all of my Pokemon EDBs. And we've got some here. And we have that uh, Charizard Ultra Premium Collection thing, or whatever it's called. I actually bought a, the best card you could pull from Brilliant Stars. It was the Charizard Ultimate Art. Um, so it definitely, I definitely got my money back from uh, spending that much, an extortionate amount on that uh, short of, uh, Sword and Shield uh, collectors up there. So yeah, just pretty much uh, like a like my hobby collection collection yeah <laughs> basically just nerdy nerdy type stuff just adorned it pretty much it is just pretty much nerdy stuff that is just everywhere pretty much so yeah so here we have what is being deemed the bookshelf but it's not it's not really a bookshelf it's you know half assed bookshelf but um I guess it's some stuff from the top so here we actually have my headphones case they are the Sony XM4s, I think they're called. I don't know, but they're fantastic. Highly recommend them. We have this penguin that 
so oh, let me just come back in front of the mirror so thank you how do I position this thank you guys